Here we are. Hey, Brucey. Nico! One second. Sorry. <clears throat> Why didn't you tell me it was Nico? Why? Man, women. Man. Women. Yeah. 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 Man, I'm ready for you, Nikki. I'm ready. I'm ready for fucking anything. Yeah. Wah. 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 Are you all right? You seem a little tense. Yeah, sorry, I'm, I'm just juicing. Makes me a little pent up. Juicing? Yeah. Bull shark testosterone, amigo. Ordered online from Chile. Makes you feel really male. Hey, be careful, man. I heard that stuff does funny things to your balls. Hey, do I look like I got funny balls to you? <laughs> I haven't considered it. Uh, you sent me a message. What do you want? Want help? I'm losing the plot here. Pause. Now, I'm shitting you, man. Now look, you did really good with that thing. A lot of people are very grateful. Now listen, that guy Lyle had a car worth stealing. Can you get it? He left it in an alleyway off of Yorktown Avenue in Steinway. If you pay like last time, no problem. Yeah, of course. Any risks? Nah. Easy as can be. Yeah. <sighs> Okay, uh, I'll just go take care of it then. Yeah! Bye. Where you want to go, Heffy? So, uh... This is it, my compadre. We're here. Thanks. Ain't got no kind of manner. No risks, Brucey? Maybe this juicing is fucking with your head. He trying to take Lyle's ride. That's Lyle's ride. Brucey asked me to bring this by. 
You're lucky it looks as good as it does. The only thing Brucey thinks is good looking is himself in the mirror. Thanks. The car is in your lockup. It was not so easy. People were waiting for me. Shit, man. If I'd known it'd be like that, I'd have gone to get it. People don't fuck with Brucey. I mean, you're cool, though. You made it, man. You got the mad red army driving skills. I'll sort you out with some big rims, spinning ones, crazy original styles, you know? We'll cruise, we'll hang. All right, all right? Thanks, homie. Thanks. So can you take me? Let's do it. Thanks a lot. Dimitri, you got my money? I have it. Meet me at the warehouse in Maganet in downtown Broker. Come along. All right, my brother. Me and him Russian and seriously vexed with you. I only pissed off one. He's dead. I'm going to meet Dimitri to collect on the hit. Yo, Nico, you better watch your back, you know. We know you're wicked, but them boys them are some dog art, you know. I'm not afraid of him. Yeah, my eyes can't see, the heart can't leap at you know. May I come with you? Where's the place? A warehouse on Mohanet. I know the one. You see around the back. Thanks, Dick. Huh? You don't know, my avid scene star. Hey, Nico. Glad you can make it. Yes. You got the money? Sure. But I just wanted to say how grateful me and my bosses are for what you did. Good. Yes. And I just wanted to check something with you. Okay. You are Nico Bellic, correct? What is this? And you used to work the coast in the Mediterranean, smuggling people into Italy. I don't know what you're talking about. But you messed up and left a lot of bad debt. You left a good friend of mine out of pocket, big time. Hello, Nico. Hello, Mr. Bulgarin. Where is our money? I don't know. I didn't rob you. 
Really? We were busted a mile off the coast. I had to swim for my life. I don't know what happened. I nearly drowned. Huh. My heart was bleeding. I did my best. I didn't fuck up. Well, there you are. Ah! Ah! Babylon, man. Power back in the cafe now. Yeah, I need to block up some more. Shut up, Come here now, I can't lag ahead. I told you to meet you with a snake in the grass. I didn't know that Mr. Bulgarin was here in Liberty City. If I could have killed them all then and there. Just chill, Nico, man. One at a time. One, one quarter of field basket. See? You find out where Dimitri is, then BAM! You take the rest of them all. Let's keep your head down until then. Fucking Dimitri. 
made me kill Faust, and then he sailed me down the river. Just go on, Nico. The boy is a general, you know what I'm saying? He's gonna make his own downfall. The higher the monkey climb, the more he makes pose and battle, you see it? I will bring Dimitri down myself. I promise you this. I'm gonna speak to Batman. You keep on alone, call your woman and get out of this place. Hey, thanks for your help, Jacob. One love, my brother. Roman! Roman, where are you? In here! I'm stuck! Let me out! Shit, man! <sighs> what are you doing in there? I got scared. People started calling the house and hanging up. You weren't answering your phone! What happened? We've got a big problem. Dimitri was not a man of his word. So we're dead? More or less. Everything was fine before yes. you. Yes. Fine, and now this! Thank you! Thanks a lot! It's Vini! Nibit. What's done is done. Yes. But there's a bigger problem. What? That guy I owed money to, Bulgarin. Yes, the guy in <sighs> Europe. Who lives by the Adriatic? Yeah, yeah, he's here now. <sighs> Great. I'm sorry. I've ruined your life. No, don't be like that. We, we can find a way out of this. Bunch of idiot Russians. I will kill every one of them. No, that's exactly what you won't do. We don't have time for revenge. We can't afford it. What can we afford? Uh, we can lay low and start over. Please. Come on. Let's go back to the apartment. We can pick up our stuff, and then get out of here. I'll call Mallory. She might have somewhere we can hide out. Hey, beautiful! Um, listen, me and Nico are in a bit of trouble. Um, need to get out of Brooklyn in a few days. Any of your cousins have a place we could use out in Bohem? Oh, you're an angel. Beautiful and kind. I love you. We'll see you there. <sighs> Maybe things are not so bad. This I did not expect. I was thinking about getting out of the cab business. Last night I had a dream. Really? Yes. You and I had a place of our own. A place where people come to eat and relax. Classy place. None of this fast food diner bullshit. We own a real restaurant. A tavern. It's a place of distinction, you know? I can't see myself settling down. Not now, but in the dream you've met the right woman. She's beautiful, pure like my Mallory. In the dream, Mallory and me are married and everything is perfect. You're kidding me! Shit! Holy fuck, it's fucking burning! The whole place! I've got to go in! I've got to get something! Leave it, cousin. 
This place is gone. They burnt it! They fucking burnt it, Nico! Do you know how long it took me to get a place of my own? You got off the boat and I was here for you! I know you were. I got here and I had nothing! Nobody! Jesus! It's on fire! Fuck! I've got nothing left! Not my home, not my business, nothing! They took it all! I'm sorry, Roman. I'm really sorry, but we have to go. We'll meet Mallory and Bohan. You still have her. And you! For all the good you've done me! Do you know how long it took me to get set up here? You don't, because it was easy for you. You had it all from day one. It took me months to get some cash together. Finally I bought a cab, and then another. Then I got the depot. I slept under my desk at that place for over a year. Then I got the apartment. The apartment you thought was so shitty. Well, it doesn't matter. And now it's gone, along with everything else. I said I was sorry. You have a lot to apologize for. Since you got here, I've had my computer smashed. I've been beaten up. I was kidnapped and then shot in the stomach. My apartment got burned down and so did my business. Things have been going so great. Just great since you showed up. You remember that time when we went to the bar back home and found it raised to the ground? Just a pile of rubble. Everything smashed. Except for that one bottle of vodka. Yeah, we sat down and finished it off there and then. Wait, wait, I don't want to talk about back home. We're here in America now. And I should be thinking about my life here. My life, which is ruined. Just drive, shut up, drive. <laughs> Hey, beautiful. What's up? No, what do you mean? I haven't been crying since my allergies. <laughs> Nico's wearing this new cologne. <laughs> yeah, trying to impress Michelle or something. You're coming to your cousins, are you there? Great. See you in a bit, beautiful. My dream? It was just that. A dream. I can't have the tavern now. I have nothing to buy it with. I, I have nothing. I told you. You still have Mallory. But I wanted to really have her. I wanted to marry her. You can still do that. I had bought her a ring. That is what I wanted to show you. It was a beautiful ring. It was, it was worth you. <laughs> now I have nothing. <laughs> Come on. Oh. Roman, pull yourself together. You've been here before. Positive mental attitude. Come on. Mm. At least they want me dead, and not you. <sighs> I do not think it will be much difference to them, Nico. One dead Belik will give them a little bit of happiness while they wait for next. I do not know. We are in this situation. We must deal with it. Bring on Bohan! Okay. Here we are. The beginning of our new lives. Again. Not so bad. <laughs> I mean, I don't think we'll be impressing women with our wonderful hot tub, but uh, this looks okay. Yes, great. Come on, what's, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Where should I start? All right, I'll start with you. What's wrong with you? Fifteen minutes ago, you were cowering in fear because you didn't know what was going to happen. Now, you know everything is shit, and you're going to be killed, and you're all cheerful. I don't get it. I guess I'm an optimist. An idiot, not an optimist. I was bored of Broker anyway. I'm glad you turned up and made some Russian killers burn down my oh. home and business. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Nico. Thanks a bunch. Is that better? March! Thank God you're okay. Both of you. We're fucked. We're broke and on the run. No, I'm from up here, Nico. I know a bunch of people who might be able to help out. Why don't you come and meet me at the community center later on? I gotta go to work. Bye, Papi. And have a shower. You smell a little, um, mature. So, 
I guess we start again. Sure. I'm going out. <laughs> 